Hey guys, so I had somebody ask me if I can elaborate a little bit about how I would use the Pixify in Quarry form on my website um, and then how that would translate into me using the lead module to contact my client. So this is just to give you kind of an overall view of how Pixify can work really well for you in trying to automate your responses to your client and save you a lot of time when you are, are trying to respond to emails and leads. Okay. So if you didn't watch the last video, I would suggest you doing that because I'm not going to elaborate too much on this, but the last video shows you how to set up an inquiry form via your Pixify module. Okay, so the inquiry form looks like this, and each inquiry form has a link that goes with it. Now, I know that everybody's website is different. Some people use Blue Domain, some people use you know, Zenfolio. I'm just going to show you based on my website and what how I would use this form. So based on this link right here, I would just copy this link, and I use Show It. So... Um, what I'm going to do is I'm gonna just going to go ahead and customize my contact link to this URL and copy the link directly right here. Anytime somebody clicks here, it would automatically bring them to this page. So my blog, I would customize this link right here to open up to this same inquiry page. Okay. So let's say that somebody is going to inquire with me. So they would just say it's a wedding inquiry and they're going to go ahead and type in all this information and press submit. Once they press submit, it's going to sit again, send them a thank you message saying thank you so much for contacting me. I will reach you within 24 hours. You'll get an email in your inbox and it looks like this. Okay. So now when you go to your Pixify module, you should see that you got that lead right here. Okay. So we're just going to go to the lead. This is the current lead. And now in this area, this is when you would be able to use this area to kind of to really help you kind of save time on responding to your leads and um, getting more information from your leads as well. So what I usually do is I like to use the questionnaire area and you're welcome to look back at the previous video, video showing how I use questionnaires for weddings or I use like to use the contact area. Okay. So in the contact area, you press compose message and I already have several different templates of messages that I always send out to every client that inquires. This really helps save me a lot of time because I have messages that I saved via a Word document, but then I would have to open it up, paste it for every email. And this is already already in Pixify, so it only takes two clicks for me to be able to send the client a message. So say for instance, if they're inquiring about my engagement special that I'm holding right now, um, I could just quickly you know, put that in, the subject line still is there, and it just press send, and that took me like 30 seconds. So how you customize these templates is you go to Templates Communication, okay, and now you can go ahead and type in all type of communication that you commonly will send to your bride and groom or to your clients in this tab right here, okay. Um, the other thing that you can do is really help save time is under Brands, and then under inquiry automation form, this is also where you would put your thank you message for when they submit. But also what you can do is you can put a certain template uh, to be automatically emailed them to them once they press submit, which saves you tons of time. So that means you don't have to go and do that. So the only time you would be really need to respond back to them is if they responded back to the previous template email that you sent out. Okay. Um, so hopefully this kind of helps clarify things about how to use Pixify, at least in the lead module area. Uh, and if you have other areas that you would like me to elaborate on, please make sure to message me. As always, I do videos every week. Make sure to subscribe to this channel to keep up more tips and tricks. Talk to you next time.